What's up guys? Hope everybody's doing well and having a great day. In this video, I'm going to show you guys a collection of various videos from different locations around the world of what appear to be Starlink satellite trains, but these are not Starlink satellite trains. Some you're going to see in the daytime sky and some you're going to see in the nighttime sky. They're very mysterious. I don't know what we're looking at, but I do know they're not Starlink satellite trains. In case you haven't seen a Starlink, this is what they look like. This video was sent in by, by Christine B of one of the Starlink satellite trains orbiting the Earth. These satellites that orbit the Earth, and there's many, in fact, there's thousands. Here's another view, video sent in by Javi, I'm not sure of the location. But what they're doing, they're offering broadband internet services to very remote locations of planet Earth. But anyway, that's what a Starlink satellite train looks like in the nighttime sky. We don't normally see them in the daytime sky, but you're going to see a video here in just a moment that kind of looks like a small version of a Starlink satellite train in broad daylight. I'm going to take you guys to Ohio. We're in Cincinnati, Ohio. This video footage was sent in by Angela D. And she pulled her car over, got out of the car, and started recording this string of lights in the sky. And it was right before sunset above Cincinnati, Ohio. I don't know what we've got going on here, but this looks similar to what you guys are going to see here in just a minute above California. It was a row of lights that looked like a small version of a Starlink satellite train that I just showed you guys at the beginning of the video. These disappeared. They remained here. She had a, a witness with her that was in the car, and they were both out of the vehicle looking at these lights as they mysteriously came back into view. They weren't behind the clouds. They just kind of turned off and then they turned back on. Just a mysterious row of lights above Cincinnati, Ohio. So what I did, I took this original video and I did a little bit of enhancement work just trying to pull forward any possible features. And as you can see, they didn't look much different. We had four lights in the sky and a straight row above Cincinnati, Ohio. Video footage taken and witnessed by Angela D. I want to take you guys now to some other locations. A daytime Starlink, and that's a, a big question mark, spotted in the sky above Orlando, Florida, right here along the I-5 corridor. And here they are. See what I mean? How these look like a, a daytime version of a Starlink satellite train? This video footage was taken by Chris S. from Orland, California back in March of 2021. Around 1.20 in the afternoon. Skies were clear. There weren't any clouds anywhere as far as you could see, at least in this direction. And he was completely taken back. He just said right there, this is so weird. And that's what he just said, looking at Starlink in the daytime. He, and he said that with a, a question mark behind it because you don't normally see Starlink satellite trains in broad daylight, only in the early morning sky before sunrise. And he just said it again, Starlink in the daytime, because that's what it looked like. Wasn't quite as long as a Starlink satellite train, but there are five, at least five visible objects that appear to be the same shape and size, and they appear to be white. These are enhanced versions of the original video. I was just trying to pull forward features but they didn't appear to be a Starlink satellite train. This was something different. I don't know what it was, but this was spotted in broad daylight uh, about a year ago above Orland, California. And in this next segment, you're going to see a huge stationary horizontal row of lights in the nighttime sky. This video footage was taken by Jeff G, and it was described as a huge UFO. These lights look like they were part of something bigger. As you're going to see in this video taken from from Northeast Oklahoma. A couple of these lights that you see here in a nice straight row kind of flicker on and off. Some of them remain on the entire time of the video. Here I put it in fast forward just for presentation purposes and you can see the ones that were blinking and the ones that were not. They looked like they were part of something bigger. They remained in a nice straight line. They did not move. They remained in this location. In this next segment, I enhanced the, the original video trying to pull forward any possible features. I was looking for the backside of possibly a large craft as it did look like these lights were attached to something larger but you couldn't see anything other than the lights and here I, I did some enhancement work the top part I zoomed in on the original video and the bottom it remained the original video I zoomed in looking for again any possible features or anything like that those two lights you see right there in the middle remained on and the one right next to it remained on the entire time the lights to the left and to the right of those lights 
blinked on and off. And if you look real close right there, you can see a real dim light that is also in line with the rest of those lights that appear to be in a perfect line. So that kind of rules out to me any possible Chinese lantern scenario or anything like that. To me, those did look like they were part of something larger. Now you're going to see a vertical row of lights in the nighttime sky. This video was sent in by David H. I'm not sure of the location. Get a load of this, would you? Here's the original over here on the right. Over here on the left, I zoom in. And he noticed this row of lights that was standing tall, either in the southern sky, the eastern sky, or the western sky. And this is not Starlink. Far as I know, that could have been the northern sky. I don't know where this was at. Here I enhance the original video. Look over here. Looks like a big, tall tower, but that's not a tower. That extends many miles up into the sky. That is a row of stationary lights just sitting there in the nighttime sky. Looks like a stationary version of one of those very long Starlink satellite trains. But these lights are not moving. These look like they're not blinking. They look like they are on during the duration of this video. And look at how high up those go. Look at that. That is unreal. I have never seen anything like that. A stationary row of tall vertical lights that extend way up into the sky. I wouldn't think those were drones because they go up so high. That is something highly unusual. Don't even want to speculate what we've got going on here. So just to rule out, to show you guys one more time that this was indeed not a Starlink satellite train, here is one in action video sent in by Dan from Ottawa, Ontario, of the Starlink passing over Canada. And once you've seen one, then they're unmistakable. You'll, you'll always know what you're looking at when you see one of those in the nighttime sky. I've never heard of anybody seeing one in the daytime sky. I've actually seen a couple myself in the early morning hours, around 5 o'clock in the morning, and they look like this over here on the left. In fact, the, the lights were spread out even farther than what you see here. Very long, unmistakable. You knew what you were looking at. It was a Starlink satellite train. What we're looking at here, a vertical row of lights that extends many miles up into the sky. That is highly unusual. I don't think I've ever gotten a video sent in of lights that look like that. And I'm waiting to hear back from David on the exact location of this incredible video of these towering lights that he saw in the nighttime sky. Thanks for the photos and videos, guys. Keep them coming. Coming over here to the homepage of the website, today's feature photo was sent in by Ginger. Not sure of the location, but she captured some goldish orange contrails in the early morning or evening sky. If you guys have any photos you'd like to share, you can send those to reports at MrMBB333.com. If you have any videos you'd like to share that won't attach to the email for whatever reason, come over here to the homepage of the website. Look for this red tab that says Have a Large Video. Simply click on that red tab, drag and drop your video into that banner. Please include your first name, date, and location, and I'll take it from there. Thanks for watching. Have a super day, and be safe out there.